embedding Google Docs and YouTube videos. So I'm just going to show you what I did in that first video in a little bit more detail. So I logged out in account settings of my Google Drive. Um, that's an account settings integration. It's a good idea to log out of those things. Um, anything that you don't, Miro doesn't need access to, or if you're not using Miro for a while, log out all that stuff. Um, and now I'm going to go to the upload menu and Google Drive, and it'll ask you to sign in because I'm. This is what this is what it'll do the first time. You know, it'll say, "Okay, sign in with your Google account." Great. You got to give it access to all your drive files. It can't do it one at a time for whatever reason. And you know, I'll just put a baby shower document in here, and there we go. That's throwing it in there. It's just showing you that you have to log in and log out of Google Drive if you and any other private document system that you have if you want to embed them in here. This is embedded via an iframe. Videos just embed through something called an iframe. We just accept that. And there's a little place where we can paste iframe code. And you can paste iframe code and the video will just show up on the page as an object. That's it. So if we go to this video I was looking at before and we go to share, that's where YouTube has the embed code and it starts with the word iframe, ends with the word iframe. You don't care, just copy it. There's a copy button on every video site for the embed code. It embeds here with this little paste iframe thing on the more tools menu, paste it, embed, and you're done. That's it, that's how you put a public video in there. I might make another video if we have, you know, a few more things that we need to cover, but I feel like I've kind of killed it right now. And that's how you embed documents. Just, you know, ping me when you have questions.